Good day, mates. Good day, mates. It is a, uh, it's a Monday morning. It's a Monday morning in, uh, in beautiful Sydney. And uh, I'm out on a, uh, I'm out on a little bit of a walk doing some morning exercise before a, uh, it's gonna be a long day. I'm, I'm waking up in Sydney, but I'm going to bed in Perth. And I thought I would just get out and get a little exercise and bring you along. And what you're looking at behind me, this is the, uh, if I'm not mistaken, this is the, the, the Darling, Darling Key or, or, or something. It's a, <laughs> I'll look on a map and uh, I'll let you know for sure. But anyway, it, this is a spot, it, it says Marina. And this is a spot that uh, I came across as I'm just walking along. And if I actually look at the uh, look at the map, it looks like it's the well, it's the Darling Harbor. You're looking at the Darling Harbor Convention Jetty, just across the water. So I am going to uh, just walk and talk and bring you along on this uh, rather beautiful. It's a rather beautiful Monday morning, and uh, all the locals. All the locals are hurrying about going to uh, going to school or or they're uh, you know going to work or doing what you smell that no you wouldn't smell that but I do oh boy something smells really fishy it smells really fishy more fishy than I've ever imagined something smelling. Wow, it's actually overwhelming. I don't know, I don't know where it's coming from. Holy cow. I, I'll find it though. I'll find it, I'm good. I'm good at finding things that are, that <laughs> I'm good at finding things that smell fishy, you know? But uh, kind of like a, What's the saying? You know, a house guest is like is like fish. After three days, it starts to it starts to smell or something like that. But uh, anyway, I'll see. I'll see. I'm going to. Uh, I'm just going to walk along. I'll I'll stop and give you a nice nice view of this place. I actually visited this place some time back, several years ago, Darling Harbor. And boy, there's some beautiful boats that are. Uh, moored i think is the word just right over there but uh let's go see if i can't find uh let's go see if i can't find what's causing this 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 smell just up ahead after walking through the the harbor i came to this bridge the p-y-r-m-o-n-t bridge pyramont bridge perhaps and it says the uh, bridge first opened in 1858 and was replaced by the current bridge in 1902. And though modest at first sight, the bridge was highly innovative when built between 1899 and 1902. It was among the very first to be fitted with an electric, electrically operated central span, which swings open at the flick of a switch. The trusses supporting the bridge were designed by NSW engineer Percy Allen and were known as Allen trusses. The method of construction was later adopted around the world. The bridge closed to traffic in 1981. Look at that bridge. And for those of you that are in into bridges, which I know a lot of people are, engineers in particular, I have a brother that is a, a structural engineer. And uh, I know individuals like himself might be interested in seeing the the construction or the under underside of the of the construction here. Look at that. Quite old. That's something. And there's your uh, Australian flag. I was walking along thinking that, I just never think of that the same, seeing that that flag having been down here for the uh, year that I have. It's actually been a, uh, a year today. It was a year ago today that I landed in Australia. Imagine that as I show you the Australian National Maritime Museum here. And then right out here, wow, look at this. 
and I almost almost actually walked right past this look at this ship right here or ships I should say look at that there's two of them there's the the old and the, the old and the newer Boy, what a what a view it's all part of the National Maritime Museum here in Sydney look at that ship Wow and just over here you have a well look at the look at the look at that look at that submarine and it's not yellow if it were yellow I might want to ride it but uh, we're living it isn't that the saying we all live in a yellow submarine a yellow submarine a yellow submarine isn't that how the isn't that how the song goes look at that all right I might want to hang around here a little bit might want to hang around here a little bit more but I want to find out what smells so fishy there's something there's something in the air that smells fishy and I, I want to get to the bottom of it I knew I smelled something fishy you know I've been around I've been around long enough to know when something smells fishy and look at this I found it I found I found the source it's a Sydney fish market oh boy I should have I should have known that there was a fish market around and uh, oh wow what a uh, what a uh, what a find uh, you know you just never know what you're gonna find when you go out on a on a morning walk and apparently I'm in the back of the fish market. I'm in the, uh, I think I'm in the loading area here. Look at all of this. Uh, you see all these, these trucks coming in and out? You know, the fresh seafood? And here you got guys on their, uh, well, I guess they're, I guess they're loading up. I guess they're loading up all the, the fish back here to send it out to the, send it out to the markets. I don't know what I can share with you, but maybe give you a little behind the scenes here of the fish market look at some of this stuff here wow this all looks like uh that all looks like salmon and i don't know what this is look at that i'm not quite sure what that is but boy it looks it looks pretty good so i'm gonna take you i'm gonna take you for a little little walk and talk and uh in doing so if i'm able to show you some of the behind the scenes i've been looking on online for some footage of this wonderful place and uh a lot of it uh is 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 in it actually in the fish market not the not the behind the scenes stuff but look at this from the wild waters of tasmania you see there's your your hewan hewan salmon and uh you know a few months ago i wouldn't have even known what hewan was but uh i've been to the hewan valley and uh, and I know, I know, I know what the Hewan, I know what the Hewan Valley is. But I'm gonna somewhere find myself a little uh, a little brekkie somewhere. They they've got to have some some brekkie here somewhere around the uh, the market. But look at all this stuff going out. Isn't that interesting? The Sydney Fish Market. Wow. Look at this. Really, something else. All right, let's go see if I can, let's go see if I can't find my way into the uh, into the fish market itself and share that uh, share that with you. Here's the uh, look at these vans here. Getfish.com.au. If you if you want to order yourself some some fish, let's go check out the. Uh, We'll go check. We'll go check out the the inside the inside of this fish market. I knew something smelled fishy. 
I'll take a stab at it. Mazumechi. Mazumechi seafood. And uh, I'm going to see if I can't find my way into the main hall. But this little place here is just right out on the outside. And look at all of this stuff. Wow. Female green blue swimmer crabs. Look at that. Boy, there's just no shortage of stuff. Look at all this. And here is the large male green swim blue crabs. These would be the male. Look at that. Oh boy. That looks good. Holy cow. Oh, there's some, uh, these are some live male mud crabs. Look at that. Careful they don't snap my, uh, snap my finger. Oh, he's posing. Oh, what a place. And here's your calamari. It says skin damage, whatever, whatever that means. But uh, here's your... Here's your calamari, here's your octopus that's been tenderized. Wow, look at these saucer scallops. Boy. Hello. Fantastic. What a boy, what a place. Here's your live spring bay blue mussels. Oh, Yellow belly flounder. I've been called yellow belly before. Uh, wow, this really is something. Look at this scorpion fish. This is just the uh, this is just the uh, the outside shop. I, I, I as I understand it, there's a whole there's a whole market yet to be seen. And here, this would be the this would be the market, folks. Look at this live live seafood. No shortage of places to find a little bit of something to eat <laughs> you got the mixed grilled lobster platter two people a hundred bucks look at that boy i bet skip smith of the villages would just absolutely love this place look at all of this Hungry mussels Oh, and over here, look at this. Salmon and scallop, three for $11. Boy, that looks really good. Look at that. Does it have lobster mornay with garlic butter? Oh boy, folks, this stuff. This love stuff looks just, uh, just too good. Holy cow. 
Look at all the wonderful food that you can get here. They're still setting up. It's early in the morning. There you have some seasoned white bait. Here's your uh, salt and pepper prawns. Oh, boy. Salt and pepper calamari. Look at that. Very nice. Oh, and if you like oysters, here's your, here's your oysters. Wow. Chili ponzu. Here's your, here's your lobster. Look at that. Wonderful. Oh boy. Now, Thank you. Do you have a lid on something of this? These sushi tacos. Boy, that looks good. That looks really, really good. Eight dollars for one or fifteen for two. Oh wow! Thank you so much, my dear. Appreciate that. Hey. Eh? Have a lovely that. day. Bye. Look at that. Does that look delicious? Or what? Oh. oh, and I'm not sure what this is, but look at here. Boy, they get all types of good things. Look at that. Mixed sushi. Three fifty each. Now there's a large mixed seafood set. Oh. Holy cow. It looks just fabulous. What a nice place this is. I'm sure there's going to be no shortage of interesting things to, to see here at the, uh, at the Sydney fish market. Now this is quite interesting. Baylor, Baylor shells. Isn't that? I have no idea what that is. That's something. Baylor, Baylor shells. And these are turban shells here. Japanese scallop meat. What a place. You know, when the, when the Aussies say that they're going to put some steak and prawn on the Barbie, they don't mess around. Look at this. See, the Aussies say don't mess around when it comes to the prawn. <laughs> that is some... Um, that is some prawn there. Wow. You Aussies don't mess around when it comes to the prawn, huh? We Americans, we put steak and shrimp on the Barbie. But you guys put steak and prawns, right? <laughs> That's a little bit of a joke. All the Americans say steak and shrimp on the Barbie. Here's some blue swimmer crabs. Chile. Eastern rot lobster cooked local. These are razor clams. I've never heard of never heard of razor clams before. And in case you're wondering where the uh, in case you're wondering where the sushi comes from, this these guys here are I think are making the uh, Making their sushi. Good morning. Good morning. Good day, mates. <laughs> uh, 
this is the sashimi, sashimi bar. And I think what they're making is this stuff here. Look at that. I would think that on a weekend that this place would just be packed. And it's rather early in the morning right now. Here you can buy yourself some, some nice bread. Get yourself a nice little nice little sandwich here for brekkie. Maybe a maybe a long back black. Wow. Here's your baby octopus. Look how cute that is. Here's a nice deli right here. Very nice. Really, really nice. All right. I'm going to see if there's anything over on the, the other side. There may be another another hallway here. We will uh, see as the saying goes. The Fish Market Cafe. I thought maybe that there was, but perhaps not. This may be the uh, this is this is the extent I believe of the of the vendors inside. So. Folks, I hope you enjoyed your hope you enjoyed your tour. And if you're uh, if you're ever in Sydney, walking around and you're you're wondering what's what's smelling fishy, there's a probably good chance that uh, that it's this here the uh, the Sydney the Sydney fish market. So have a uh, have a great day. We're filling up some containers down here with some live. King crab, look at that. Now this thing is actually waterproof, and I may be able to let me see if I can't do that. There you go. There's your there's your underwater there's your underwater view of the uh, of these items here. Oh, that's one uh, one nice thing about having a uh, having a waterproof uh, having a waterproof camera. Anyway, have a uh, have a great day, folks. I take. Uh, I keep seeing stuff that I want to share with you. I, I want to say goodbye, but uh, then I, I I look and I see something something else that might be of interest to share. And uh, look at this. A face only a mother could love, huh? Here's looking at you, kid. These big ones. Holy cow. That is a fish. All right, folks. Have a uh, have a wonderful, wonderful day from the uh, Sydney Fish Market.